Hi everybody, welcome back to the Civivi YouTube channel. My name is Seth. Today we're taking a look at the newest member of the Elementum family, the Fixed Blade Elementum. We've got two versions available. These are gonna be dropping on May 20th. Set your calendars, they will go fast. Uh, come on in and take a close look. I'm gonna show you the differences between the two and let you get excited about this new Fixed Blade from Civivi. First thing when you get your new Fixed Blade Elementum, you're gonna notice that it comes in some really nice packaging. Um, nice box that's got your cleaning wipe, um, your knife. Uh, they both come with a lanyard that's attached to the knife and then a sheath um, in the bottom of the box there. So um, like I said, really nice packaging. You're gonna get that with either of the, the different versions, stickers and everything. Um, the Kydex sheath that comes with this version and all that is packaged nicely in your nice box here. So let's take a look at these and I'll show you the differences. Okay, first up we have the all blacked out version that comes with a Kydex sheath. Um, this has flat G10 handles. Um, it's a full tang fixed blade knife, both of them are. Um, but you can see that the handles on this one are flat and there's no contouring on those handles there. Um, somebody mentioned when I showed them this knife that uh, you could actually probably fabricate your own scales for this, which I think would be pretty cool if you're into that kind of thing. You can just pop off those scales and, and put your own on there. Um, this version comes with a really nice Kydex sheath. It's got a super strong lock up in there, clicks right in, uh, doesn't rattle around, and it's gonna keep your knife super secure in there, and then it pops out just great. Um, the, another benefit of this knife right here is it comes with the Bob Terzola designed T-clip, which is a super nice uh, way to attach it to either your belt or a backpack or something like that. Really versatile, you can uh, unscrew it and flip it around so that you can carry the blade horizontally or scout carry. Um, you can adjust it for the size or the thickness of the belt that you're wearing. Um, or if you are going to put it on a thinner webbing on a backpack or something like that, it'll fit on there. And then it just snaps into place. So super nice T-clip and Kydex sheath that comes with this version of the knife. Um, this guy is going to be come in D2 steel with that black stone washed finish on the blade. And um, just like the Elementum, it feels super nice in the hand. I'm gonna show you, compared to a couple of other Elementums here, the size. Um, the size on this thing is an overall length of 8.48 inches, and the blade length is 3.98 inches. So you're just under four inches on the blade, um, and the handle is four and a half inches. So compared to the new button lock Elementum, Look at that, the handle is just about the same size, but the blade there is about a half inch larger than the button lock Elementum. And then the original Elementum is obviously smaller than both of those. So that gives you a little bit of a size comparison. It's the whole family all together, the original Elementum, the button lock Elementum, and the new fixed blade Elementum. Just like the other members of the Elementum, Elementum family, the fixed blade Elementum has a really nice hollow ground blade. It's super slicey. The blade thickness is 0.14 inches, and this comes in at an MSRP of $87, and you will find it for a little bit less than that at dealers. The next version of the fixed blade Elementum comes in at the same size, size with the exception of the thickness of the handle. Um, you can see that the handles are very, very different and then obviously the finish on the blade is different. Um, we actually went with a different blade steel on this version of the fixed blade Elementum as well. So on the black version you have a D2 steel and on the satin version you have the 10CR15COMOV. Uh, which is a, a fairly new steel that you haven't probably seen around too much, but it's going to give you a little bit better corrosion resistance than the, um, the D2, and it's a, a great uh, steel for a fixed blade. Okay, so looking at the differences on the handle here, they're both G10, but extremely different. The fixed blade here has that textured, more rough uh, G10 surface, and then here we've got a polished G10 um, that's contoured, so you get a little bit uh, more of a... Um, uh, what would you call it, a, a, a different kind of a grip in your hand where that contours to your hand a little bit. It feels really, really good in your hand. And then we've got a layered G10 in there. So you've got the red um, right next to the, the blade stock and uh, the black, which has that really cool layering in it as well that gives it almost a uh, almost the look of a wood um, 
or, or my Carter or something, but whatever it is, it looks really nice and you're really gonna like it. Um, both of these knives have the jimping on the top of the blade to give your thumb some good traction. Um, uh, again, they use that nice hollow ground blade um, that we have all grown to love from the Elementum. Another cool feature that we've got on here, um, from the original Elementum you have that flipper tab. Um, when you flip it down, it comes down and it creates that little um, area where you can put your finger to get a nice grip on the knife. Well, we have the same thing on these fixed blades that acts as a finger guard to um, keep your fingers from slipping up onto the blade. And then you can also choke up onto that and get a really good grip on it um, for nice detailed work. Um, these fixed blades are super, super comfortable in the hand. One of the other major differences that you're going to see between the contoured handle and the um, black flat handle version is the sheath that it comes with. The satin blade contoured handle comes with this really nice leather sheath. Um, your knife fits in there really nice and snug. Gets a really nice snap on there. And you are off and ready to go with your leather sheath for this version. Now, um, that is, uh, oh, let's see, just about everything. I think I was gonna mention the weight. Um, the weight on these things are 5.47 ounces. Um, the blade thickness on both of these is 0.14 inches. Um, you've got a really nice size of blade stock there for all of your everyday fixed blade tasks. Now, uh, for those of you who have a sharp eye, you may have noticed that this Elementum is a little bit different than what you have seen before. That's because this is a layered G10 with black and white scales, and it is a special Blade Show exclusive knife. All right, everybody, thanks for watching along with us today. Um, you've got a nice look here at the whole Elementum family. Um, remember again, we've got the Blade Show exclusive version right here that we'll be uh, selling at the Blade Show. The button lock Elementum is sold out everywhere, but it will be restocked at the end of June or uh, early July, so keep an eye out for that second release there. And your fixed blade Elementums are both going to be available on May 20th. So jump on those when they come out. Um, it's a beautiful fixed blade, you're gonna love it. Um, I love it. I, I have a hard time deciding which one I like the best. Um, tell me which one you like the best in the comments and why. I'm, I'm, I really like the way the contoured handle feels, but I also really like <clears throat> the black coated blade and uh, the flat handle. So I don't know. You tell me. Which one do you like best? Thanks for watching, everybody. Have a great day.